Stop! Uh, who are you yelling at? No one. I just still have writer's block, that's all. So you're taking it out on your laptop? No, not the laptop. The, that cursor. I mean, just look at it there. Taunting me. You're just blinking on, off, on, off. Like it's so easy writing a best-selling novel. Because I'd like to see you try it, Mr. Cursor. I'd like to see you try it. So why don't we... Why don't we just say goodbye to Mr. Cursor? What is this? Fan mail? Oh, no, exactly. Remember, I went on Good Morning America a while back and offered a reward for proof of anyone who knew what happened to me during those eight weeks I disappeared. But, Castle, those letters are over a year old, and we've already proven that all the theories were ridiculous. Why are you rereading them? Looking to spark my imagination. I, but, honestly, these letters are not very inventive. They all either claim I was a victim of a government conspiracy or abducted by aliens and probed. This guy even drew a diagram of me being violated by E.T. I, I need inspiration. Beckett. And although Lester's knowledge of alien anatomy is commendable, it, it's just not enough. Oh, sorry. So I can't... Beckett. Okay. All right. I will be right there. You know that I would love to take you, but... but we have to maintain the ruse of our separation until you capture Loxhead. I know, I know. I just... What am I supposed to write about without my muse, Beckett? I need you. I, I'm Sherlock without Watson. No, you probably mean Watson without your Sherlock, because after all, my darling, you're the writer. Okay, I'll see ya. Uh, you know what? Why don't you just go to your PI office if you're so desperate for a case to solve? Maybe Alexis and Haley have something that's worthy of inspiration. <laughs>